to give you a chance to enjoy it firsthand, literally. That's this cool. is Mickey Mantle's bat from 1956, it's triple crown season. The standard for excellence among all offensive seasons, among great sluggers ever since. Now, it's not too often we have a platinum recording artist here, so we'll do something a little special for you. If you'd like to put on these gloves, Garth, you can go one step closer. You actually get to touch and hold these great pieces of baseball history. You know what? If you don't mind, I am. I'm going to be right behind you. <laughs> Thank you. Maybe this is going to be because I know what this means to you, too. Thank you so much. Nancy, this is Babe Ruth's bat. You know it. <laughs> <laughs> How many times do you get to hear that? You know that's the one that's most special to me. Uh, it never gets old saying that, I oh. promise. Babe Ruth's bat from 1922. Wow. How heavy is it? 45 ounces. 45 Holy ounces? It's a tree trunk with a knob on the end. Yeah, I'd have to drag that to the plate. There are wow, little marks in here, complete marks from knocking the dirt out of his spikes. That's great. That's Use this 1922 on into 1923, the first year at Yankee Stadium. Got it? Your hands are right where Babe Ruth's hands were. I can't even. Isn't that amazing? I can't. Stop. He's <laughs> the most famous person in America. Oh my gosh. Babe? That makes sense. He was. Yeah. People all around the world would send letters to Babe Ruth, USA. Right. And they knew where to deliver them to. <laughs> that they did. And that's it. Now. Okay, so I will return the favor. Similarities. Only similarities, okay? Nothing in talent. Mantles from Oklahoma? Yes, he is. Oh, yes. Commerce, Oklahoma? Yes. Is his number? Seven. Every hat. Every hat. That's to make me a number. Seven. That's my number. Because of metal, or it no, just that's it's just... always been my thing. But Oklahoma boys in seven, I hope it works out as good for me as it did for him. <laughs> You're the Mickey Mantle of recording artists. Yeah, look at it that way. <laughs> there you go. Thank you for this. Man. My this pleasure. Too loud. It's Mickey's bat from 1956. It's Triple Crown season. Beautiful. Feels great. The season everything came together for him. That feels great. Does it take you back to spring training? Whew. Whew. Man, that's nice. That's just, that's amazing. Beautiful. Thank you for that. Honor. My pleasure, sir. Cool. Now, that bat's about 32 ounces. It's pretty much on par with what today's players are using. This bat, Babe's, is 45 ounces. That's crazy. Just the grip on it feels twice as thick. Mm -hmm. yeah. That's crazy. It's so heavy. That's Give, crazy. Excuse me, there's a difference in years. Not the least. 1922, 1956, so 34 years. Mm -hmm. And we have one other piece here. This is Lou Gehrig's jersey that he wore in 1938, his final full season playing for the Yankees. He retired in early in the 1939 season, but he wore this in 1938, the final season of his consecutive game streak, final full season of his consecutive game streak. Wow. It's like burlap. Isn't it? It really is. That's crazy. Would you like to hold it? I'd love to. Thank you. Your hands are right where Lou Gehrig's hands were. That's great. One of the greatest players to ever put on a uniform. And the lettering of the numbers is made out of felt. Yeah. When they were longer, the felt would actually shrink first and pull away from the fabric. And if Lou could see his jersey now, he would be humbled. No question, he would be very, very humbled. That's great. I think we all, I think we all cross the bridge going to our passion to mm -hmm. try and mean to that passion what this guy meant to mm -hmm. us. For Absolutely. sure. Absolutely. Mm -hmm. There's, um, you know, there's. Great guys in our field that are this guy. The first guy that comes to mind is, you know, Jerry Douglas, Dobro player, <laughs> Bela Fleck, banjo player, Pig Robbins, piano player. These were all our our big names <laughs> in there that kind of set the, the the standard for everybody else to follow. Well, you've set the standard. Very sweet. You're in good. many ways. Thank you for this. Thank you so Thank much. You for, it's been a privilege for us to have you here. Thank it you. Is. How could you not be a fan? Thank you. A pleasure, sir. It's an honor. Thanks for this. Great gift. Very sweet. Thank you. Thank you.